welcome back to shine like a diamond um it has been a morning let me just say that so um it is saturday morning at 9 47 and um i just did my you know normal trying to get my paintings <laughs> this week the new ones that came out and um at first i thought it was sold out the one that i wanted really bad which of course Y'all know, I don't tell you what I'm getting, but come on. Y'all know, Hannah Lynn was up this week. And at first, it got sold out. And I was so sad because I have every single one of Hannah Lynn's. And I have every intention on keeping doing so. Um, But anyways, I was able to finally snatch one at 9.30. So I was very, very excited to do so. But And I got another one, but you'll just have to wait to see which one that one is next week when it comes. So I've got two to unbox here today. And then I'm going to do a part two. Um, and I'll put that one up tomorrow because I actually got three paintings this week. Um, the one came yesterday and then these two like literally came right after I got my order in for this week. <laughs> like I heard the knock on the door and I was like, what a timing. So anyways, um, let's see. I have misplaced my knife. And I'm not sure where it went. So hold on one second. We're going to do a little bit of movie magic. Okay, I got my knife. Um, not the one I was looking for, but that's okay. I've got like 15 of these. I, I keep meaning to actually put them on the shop for people if they want them on Shine Shop, on Etsy, my store. But I keep forgetting to do so because, yeah, they're really nice knives. They're really sharp. Um, and they're really inexpensive, so um, I like them better than a lot of the, you know, more spendy knives, personally. Okay, so we've got two. One and two. And we'll put that box to the side. Okay, which one shall we do first? Which one shall we do? We'll do the big one first. How about that? We'll do the bigger one first. This one is 51 by 76. All right. There we go. Get that plastic off of there. All right. Um, I have, I think, one of this artist I believe I only have one I'm not sure 100% though I might have more than one I don't know I'd have to go back and look but this one you guys oh my gosh when I saw this whoo it, it's one of those that y you need your inhaler for as Mrs. Coffee says like it she is just absolutely beautiful um ugh, okay empty the box empty sometimes you gotta really shake it to get out your your kit there so we're gonna put the sticker aside to uh, show you what I got then we'll take a look at that but first and foremost just in case you have never seen a diamond art club kit before let's take a quick look if you want to skip this part I will put the time stamp down there and you can jump to that time if you don't want to look at the, the kit. Okay, so in the kit, you will get a pen. A wonderful little squishy squishy. So that way, ugh, come on now, go on there. When you spend hours and hours, like we know you all do, um, your fingers and hand, whatever, won't get store, sore. We got some baggies. We'll just put those right back in there. We've got two pink waxes, cute little hearts. We have, this week we have a three multi-placer. That goes in the trash because honestly, don't like it. I like my thin ones. You got a, a tray with a funnel. Those of you that are a little messier like me. And because this is a square kit, you get your tweezers. Yes, these are the sharp, crazy tweezers, so be careful when using them and that is your kit um the only difference in a round kit is you just don't get the tweezers but everything else is the same so okay this is what i know you guys all want to see so let's 
get to it. Ugh. All right. I got to open it up here. And I got to take out the paper piece. Okay. Um, and this paper piece, it looks like it goes over the entire canvas. Some of them don't. Some of them do. Um, and that paper, that's just that opaque paper that... Um, I'm just rolling the, the canvas guys real quick. Um, that's that opaque paper that if you don't like the clear plastic cover, you can swap it out, which I think is awesome. I have heard that they are possibly going to be stopping doing that because it is slowing production down. If that is um, not true, don't quote me on it. That's just what I've heard through the grapevine. So, um, but anyways, whatever, I will keep mine and reuse them because I really do like them. Um, we've got your step-by-step -step instructions for those of you that are new to diamond painting. There are nine instruction steps right there. It, it will tell you everything you need to know about diamond painting. All right. You just got a little sneaky peeky there, guys. Okay, I'm gonna put the drills to the side. We'll look at those in just a few minutes. All right, I'm gonna place it sideways, so hopefully we can get all of it in. As you know, my desk is not big enough for a lot of these paintings, um, but we'll we'll try to take a peek as much of it as we can, and then we'll go section by section. So, ready? Voila! Isn't she gorgeous? Oh my gosh, what's that song? I almost started singing it. Isn't she lovely? You know that one? Ah, it is absolutely beautiful. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Seriously, you guys, like, come on. How could you not love that? Look at that hair and that crown. My word. Whew. That is some crown on her head, I tell you. I I just I really 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 like this one. Like it's it's a little bit more like risque than some. I know it's not like bad, but I'm just saying like it's it's a little less of the like um cartoonish if you know what I'm saying, which I love. Don't get me wrong. I do love them, but I love this too. I really 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 do. Ooh, I love it. Okay. Um, this one is, here, we'll turn it to the side here, and we'll just oh, put that, kind of roll it here, I don't want to roll it back, wrong ways, okay, so this one is, and it'll say right here, which, let's get a little closer for y'all so you can see it, it is a, um, 51 by 76, which is a 20 by 30 in inches. Uh, the artist is Micah Jelena. Hopefully I'm pronouncing that right. If I'm not, I apologize. Um, and obviously it's a diamond art glove. And it is a square. And look, at there's that thumbnail, guys. Woo, woo. Okay. Um, the, like I said, this is one that, that you might need. You might need one of these inhalers. Seriously, you might. Uh, it is beautiful. Like, stunningly beautiful. Um, I just absolutely love her hair in that crown. Like, phew, love it. And um, this one has 26 colors. And let's see. We have an 1AB. And that 1AB, which I could have guessed, is a 141 which is white. So all of this like stars, these stars right here, and like a ton, all of the white um, that you see in her crown are gonna be ABs, which are gonna make it just sparkle like nothing else, you guys, seriously. Um, let's see, where else do we got the ABs? And they're kind of sprinkled throughout the background to give that like starry, twinkly, you know, look it actually almost looks like there's lights like real lights at least that's what it looks to me so okay let's go down a little bit here um sorry to have to fold her head but you know we, we gotta do what we gotta do so we can see the whole painting um hopefully someday i'll have a better setup to where i can show you it a little bit better but for now this is what we got okay um there is some abs like through her hair like this white that you see 
Um, there are some ABs throughout there. Again, we've got stars down here with ABs. Um, I don't think there was any in her eyes, was there? There is. There is some ABs in her eyes. And there are, again, in her necklace, we've got ABs. All the white that you see in her necklace, those are all ABs. Um, down here in this part of her, like, bathing suit, where it's like a little chain kind of jewelry thing, got some ABs in there. Um, uh, actually, there's a couple ABs on her actual swimsuit. Uh, let's see. And over here, there's some. Man, they're just kind of sprinkled everywhere, you guys. And then this thing that she's holding, it's like a lantern kind of a thing. At least that's what it looks like to me. Um, and all of the whites you see in the lantern um, and the sprinkly sprinklies. And over here, which is like, I think it might be like a shawl or something kind of a thing. I'm not really sure. But um, it's got ABs throughout it. And then at the very bottom, we've got all of this white and white, white, all of this white, that's all ABs as well. So this one is jack full of ABs, guys. It really is beautiful. And it just, it looks like it's going to come out absolutely amazing. Like, I am very, very, very excited. Um, a lot of the ones I've been getting lately are 56 by 76. This one's 51 by 76. At least I think they're 56 by 76. I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. These, This one just seems a tad shorter than some of the ones I've been looking at lately, which I kind of like. Um, I like this size. It's kind of a perfect little size. So let's take a look at the sticker so you guys can see what it's gonna look like when it's all done oh it is just so her eyes oh my gosh you guys like seriously this one i know i say that about all of them but man isn't she beautiful isn't she lovely i don't know the rest of that song i just remember that's just what's coming to my head right now because gosh she's gorgeous absolutely gorgeous um and then you have on this, and by the way, if you are new to Diamond Art Club, this has the obviously the big picture of your painting. It has your dimensions. And then it has this wonderful um, key over here. So all of this are going to be your symbols and your DMC codes. The wonderful thing about this is, is this is actually a sticker, y'all. Like, if I can open it. Come on now. Come on. There we go. There we go. Look at this. This is a sticker. So what you can do is you can cut out these and you can put them right on your storage system. So you don't have to go out and buy separate labels. You don't have to hand write your labels. It is so wonderful. It cuts so much time out of kidding up a project. Um, don't you dare, Jack. My cat, he's about ready to jump up on my table. Um, anyways, all of the symbols, you guys, are very traditional, like, Diamond Art Club symbols. I don't see anything new, weird, or odd, um, or anything that's going to give me or anyone else, hopefully, uh, trouble. So, let's take a look at those drills, because, man, they're going to be gorgeous. Well, they always are, but uh, let me get this one. Uh, actually, I'll just roll it up real quick. Uh, okay, the real quick is, uh, yeah, sometimes, you know, I'm not the most coordinated. <laughs> oh, gracious. Okay, here we go. Get that back in her box. We can take a look at the drills, which... I love the colors of this one. Like the color palette is gonna is, is like a lot of blues um, and whites and, and blacks. Yeah, it's just it's blacks. Like there's more than one black. Oh my word. Okay, we will pull the camera down so that we can see them better. Let's see. Oops, we got it backwards here. We gotta we gotta go to the other end of the train here. Gotta go to the caboose. All right, here we are. Okay, we've got 803, 3865. We got two of those. 
We've got seven ninety seven. Three tens. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six. Six three ten. So yes, you're gonna be living that life. Let's we'll just get it out there. All right, then we've got eight twenty three, and we have two of those. Then we have three thirty four, nine thirty nine, and there are one, two, and three of those. Uh, then we have three twenty two, and then thirty seven sixty. All right, we're gonna pull the other train over here. All right, come on now. This side. Okay, here we go. 798, 519, 210, 155, 37.46. Ooh, I like that color. That is pretty. Uh, by the way, you guys, this is, we don't, I don't have any lights on. This is like just daylight, so... This is very true to color. So we've got 340, 820, 33, 3, 333. We got our ABs. 141, which this is, even though this is like the most common one, it is still, it is so pretty. Like, I don't know, it reminds me of snow coconut like that you know that coconut that you get uh in that bag that's like got the sugar on it and everything whoops i got so excited i hit my camera um it kind of reminds me of that too it's just beautiful absolutely beautiful okay then we've got 38 41 775 which i love that color 5200 we've got two of those 37 55 312 and we have two 312s uh, 796, always a favorite color of mine. Uh, 3756. One of the things I like about this color is it's like almost white, but not. It just has that like shade of that like sea foamy green. Ha, ah, love it. Then we have 3325 and 803. I swear we already had an 803. Am I nuts here? Nope, I'm not. They're just on opposite trains. This one is the lead in the train, and this one's the caboose of the other train. So we do got two 803s. All right. So that is the drills, you guys, for this one. Again, um, the name of this one, if I did, I might not have even said the name. I was so excited. Um, this is Merida, and if I'm hopefully pronouncing that right. And there she is, you guys. Absolutely gold jaws. Okay, let's get that next one. Okay, guys. Let's get this back. There we go. Okay, guys. We've got our new one to look at here. Let's get my knife back out, get this piece of plastic off. Well, that was a mistake. I guess I have to, you know, actually have the knife in the plastic to get the plastic off now. Whatever. I got it, I got it. Okay, come on. Um, this one is a little bit smaller, which I am totally okay with. Um, oops. <laughs> There's just a tiny little piece of plastic still there. A mist. Whoopsie. Okay, we got it. Now we can get into this. Ooh, is anybody else excited? Or is it just me? Is it just me? Ah, better not be just me, because, um. Eh, eh, there we go. We got it all. We got it all. All right. This one is a round, and so it does not have any tweezers, but all in all, the kit is the exact same just without the tweezers. So we won't go through that again. We will put the sticker to the side and we will look, that at, look at that in a minute, but I'm pretty sure um, I already gave it away. And I mean, most of you, <laughs> if you've been watching me for any amount of time, like y'all know what this is. I mean, for real. I have every single one of hers and I intend to keep doing so. So, all right, we're gonna open it up. 
And here are our drills, which we're gonna put to the side. We'll look at those in just a minute. This one again came with that lovely piece of paper. It does look like it covers the entire canvas, um, which is awesome. As many of these as I can get, I will take. Seriously, love those so much. All right, so um, I'm gonna roll this kit. Oh, it got folded kind of in there, not rolling, and it kind of has a little crease in it from the folding. But one lovely thing about this kit, you guys, is that, um, or not the kit, the canvas, the material of the canvas is self-unrolling, which is wonderful because you don't have to, like, mess with it a whole bunch. I just roll it backwards one time, and you're good to go. Like, any kind of fold or anything will come out, which is Awesome. So let's take a look at this. I think we can, we'll be able to see this whole thing, guys. Are you ready? Of the Ritter. Ooh. 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 Oh my gosh. Um, I'm a little bit in love with this one. Okay. First things first, as I was talking about, where it got like kind of folded right here. See that? Um, this will eventually just flatten out and go away like it never happened. It'll actually look like it was just ironed out flat, which is one thing I absolutely love about the canvases. I can't remember what the material is called. Um, it starts with a T, I think, though. Um, does it say on the box? Not that most of you care. <laughs> Oh, okay, who cares? I don't know. Anyways, um, okay, this one, the name of this one is Mona. Um, if you don't know me by now, I'm in love with Hannah Lynn and butterflies are my thing. Like, I love butterflies. So, when I saw this one, I was like, check, have to have it. So, here we go. Let's look at the schematics of it. Get down here. So we've got our little thumbnail, um, the title, which is Mona. It is a 61 by 41 centimeter, which is a 24 by 16 inch, and it is by Hannah Lynn. I love you, girl. Seriously, there has not been a painting um, or a draw, like one of her artwork pieces that I haven't liked yet. So um, she just, uh, something about the way she does the faces just draws me in. Like, I just love it. Um, I love the background of this one, you know, like it's not just her. Like I like when there's just a little bit of background. Um, and you got your wing over here cause she's a butterfly. Um, I will say though, like for, um, for Hannah Lynn from what I've done so far of hers, like this one does have a fair amount of what I would call respectable confetti. Like there are, um, like there are lines and stuff and like little chunks, but it's pretty scattered through. So, you you know, there's a little bit, it's not so color blocked. If you like um, confetti and color blocking, this one would be the one for you because it's got both. It really does. Um, you've got big chunks of color in her face, um, but it's all kind of mixed everywhere else. So yeah, it's really beautiful. Oh my gosh. And I love this size. It's like a perfect, perfect size. 61 by 41. Yes. Um, fits on my desk perfectly nice. Uh, so it won't have to hang over or anyway. Like, I love it. This one is, I think this might be the same size as Geisha, which I um, love that one. Did it in four days. That one had a lot of color blocking, though. That one was like color blocking heaven, if you like color blocking. Um, okay, this one has 32 colors. And there are three, yes, I said it, three 80s, um, which is awesome. Again, this one has your little pamphlet if you're new to dime painting or you just need a refresh of how to do it. You got your nine steps in there. Don't need that. Um, and then we got our sticker. Ooh, ooh, guys. Oh, and this, by the way, is what she's holding right here. It might be a little harder to see because it's not finished. It is an apple. Yes, it is an apple. She is in like an orchard is what it looks like to me. Um, so yeah, she's got like, we've got a tree right here. 
Um, and that tree is like fall colors. And then we've got the grass right here, like a rolling hill kind of grass. Um, and we've got like some corn stalks over here maybe and some, or it's just tall gra uh, grass that has dried out. And we've got that over here as well. Um, this is a pumpkin. So we've got pumpkin over here. Then we've got a bucket full of apples right here. And then she's holding her apple. Um, and then over here in this corner down here, we've got another pumpkin. Um, and in her hair, she's got like some fall leaves. And then back here, we've got another tree that is fall like. So that is the whole picture of Mona. So this one is a little bit more like fall colors, what you would maybe see in the fall. So this one I'll probably save actually to do in the fall. I'm weird like that. Like I saved Ice Princess to do when it was cold and snowy outside. Just the way I am. Um, so these are, there are 33 colors, like I said, and again, all of these symbols, you guys, are traditional, um, Diamond Art Club symbols, nothing new, fancy, or weird, anything that, you know, I don't think anything's gonna give you trouble. Um, they do have more than one arrows, but those arrows are very, like, vastly different color. So that shouldn't be an issue. Um, and yeah, this again, just like in that last painting, guys, it is a sticker. Love it. Absolutely loved it that they started doing these. Um, it really takes the time and effort out of kidding up a project. So Diamond Art Club, you awesome. Like, oh yes. Okay. They know I love them. <laughs> it's pretty obvious. Um, okay, so yeah, she's absolutely beautiful, you guys. Cannot wait to do her. Um, as far as ABs go, there would be um, 132, which is yellow, 134, which is green, and 141, which is white. And the symbols are 1, 2, and 3, which is pretty common for them, um, for their ABs. So we've got ABs in the eyes two ABs in the eyes. We've got the green and the white. Um, in her hair, I don't see much in her hair. Um, oh, in her, in her eyebrow bill right here, there's like, she's got like makeup on. And so this yellow through here that those are ABs. Uh, let's see. We've got some ABs going on over here. Um, and that is like a green, the green color, and that's in her hair. Um, and same with up here and over here. So we've got green ABs going through her hair. Um, let's see, what color is the, oh, and we've got a little bit of, of, uh, yellow ABs in her hair as well. I just didn't see them at first. They're kind of hidden, but no, all of this yellow, um, that you see through here is, those are ABs. Um... Say over here on this side of the painting, we've got in the grass, all of this grass, um, there are ABs through that, which of course are the green. And then we've got yellow over here in this long, like yellowy grass, um, and a little bit in the trees. And then we've got some more green ABs down here and some yellow ABs over here and over here. And yeah, so they're just kind of all over the canvas. Um, and I love that there are three ABs in this one. And one thing I really like is that they put two ABs in her eyes. There's the green of her eyes, and then there's that white, which just really, really makes it sparkle. Um, one of my favorite things about Hannah Lynn, to be honest, is the eyes. Like, I just love the eyes. Uh, they just, they're just so freaking beautiful. They just are. That's, that's all there is to it. So that is that. Let's uh, take a look. I didn't look at, I didn't do this with the last one, but they are all like, you know, sticky, 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 sticky. Um, and if you are new and you see these wrinkly looking lines and you're like, oh my gosh, there's rivers. No, they're not. This is just in the plastic. As you see, when I pull the plastic up, they go away. Um, this is poured glue, and so you're not gonna have to worry about 
uh, bubbles and rivers and all that stuff. Out of all the canvases I've got, I've never seen one in port blue, ever, ever, ever. So you don't have to worry about that, which is wonderful. Um, like I said, they're self-rolling and yeah, they're, ugh. I just gotta get these bubbles out that I just created because of the way I put the plastic back down, which it ain't, ain't a problem. It's just a me thing. I don't like when there's bubbles under the plastic. Okay. I think I got them all though. There we go. Um, okay. So that is that. She's gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Cannot wait to do this one, but I will be working on this one probably in September, I'm going to say. Um, so, okay. Let's take a look at actually first and foremost, before we take a look at the drills, I'm going to show you the drill field to show you how clear these symbols are, because honestly you could do this without a light pad if you needed to. Um, I use a light pad still like in the evening if, that, if my house is dark, just cause it's just a little bit easier to see. However, these symbols are just amazingly clear. So let's take a look real quick. All right. So see that guys, like they are just awesome. Let's go up here in her hair because that is where we've got like lots of different colors in there. Um, so see how clear those are? I mean, they are just beautiful. Like they're perfect. You really aren't going to have a problem seeing these symbols at all. So um, at, at least I don't. I've never had a problem with seeing their symbols isn't she so beautiful? Ah, love her eyes and their little lips. Like, oh, I love that this is a butterfly. Like, I'm just so ecstatic that there is a Hannah Lynn butterfly. Um, she is beautiful. All right, let's take a look at those drills. All right. Here we go. I'm going to open the trains up. unfold them all right we'll start with um yeah we'll start with the with the bigger the thicker train here we've got okay so we've got to start over on this side okay here we go these are rounds i think i already said that but just in case i didn't you can see they are very clearly rounds all right we've got 947 782, 758, 780, 742, 700, 699, 666, 814. I really like this one. It reminds me of like a brick. Uh, 321, and there are two of the 321s. I This is m probably my favorite shade of red, um, the 321s. Reminds me of like that, you know, really bright red lipstick that you, some people wear. Yeah. Okay. 7.54. Uh, now we're on our three tens. How many bags of three tens this time? We've got one, two, three, four, five, and six. So yes, you will live the three ten life because I mean, come on, there are six blacks, six of them. Yes. Okay. And then 8.15. All right, let's grab the other side here. All right. Okay, here we go. We've got 775, 300, 141 ABs. Not very many of those, you guys. Not too many, but just enough to add to that painting. Remember, this painting isn't as big as a lot of them are, so... Uh, 3843, which is one of my favorite colors. Uh, 3830, 701, 756, 3326, 3846, 3846. Yes, if you didn't know that, that's my favorite DMC uh, color. Absolutely love it. All right, 606. Baby, there's that green I was telling you about. I don't know why my camera is not wanting to focus, guys. I apologize on behalf of my camera. Not wanting to do its job. Um, 134. Come on, camera. Come on. Focus. 
Well, they are just, they're beautiful. Let me see if I can get it to do something different. We'll just go down and like, there we go. Okay, now it is focusing better. Look at those greens, you guys. Look at that. Absolute perfection. Okay, 3841. 9.96. 8.94. I like that color. That's pretty. 3778. 783. 740. 890. Baby. Whoop. Almost threw them out of my hand there. Um, we've got a little runaway here. 890 decided to try to go and have a party with the ABs. You are not welcome with the ABs, my friend. Um, 132, there, oh, there's two of them. Him and his buddy ran over. They're little runaways. Um, okay, so we've got that 132. This is that orange I was telling you about. Which, uh, if I can, oh, you know, spread them out a little bit. Aren't they gorgeous? Oh, they're just so pretty. Is anyone else just like completely like enamored sometimes by ABs? Like they're just so pretty to just sit there and look at. Then we've got uh, banana pudding, four forty-five right here, and that is it for these um, gorgeous. There's a ton of color. I love it. I love that there are three ABs in this one. I love that it's a butterfly. Um, and Hannah Lynn and all that good stuff. This one is, uh, yeah, it's going to be absolutely gorgeous, you guys. Um, so yeah, that is all I have for you today for now. If you want to join in with more of the Shine Like a Diamond fun, um, then come hang out with me tonight, 6 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. So that is 9 o'clock if you are in Eastern Time. And that would be... 8 o'clock if you're in Central. So, um, and we have lots of fun. Um, it can be a little bit all over the place, but it's a lot of fun. Um, a lot of pe cool people come and hang out with me. And we just chit-chat and do some diamond painting and uh, look at some cool stuff. So, hopefully if you have the time, come hang out with me tonight. Like I said, 6 o'clock. If not, I hope you guys have an absolutely wonderful, amazing rest of your weekend. Hopefully you can get out and enjoy some sunshine and some beautiful weather. Uh, yesterday it hit 88 here. It was hot, like hot, hot. Uh, today it's a little cooler, but still very warm. I was outside today in like my shorts and a tank top and I was perfectly comfortable. So hopefully you guys are having some good weather and you can get out and enjoy some um, fun time out side. Um, but that is all I have for you guys today. So with that being said, don't forget, as always, you are braver than you believe, stronger than you seem, smarter than you think, and you are definitely loved more than you know. So with that, keep on shining. I'll see you next time. Bye guys. Okay guys, so I've been practicing, so I just had to show you. Um, I've been really working at getting the drills back in the way they come from Diamond Art Club because they package them so beautifully. And I did pretty darn good today. Don't you think? I mean, look at that. Yes, yes, yes. I'm finally like getting the hang of it. Um, definitely took me a lot of practice. <clears throat> been ordering them fr from them for quite a while. So anyways, I just had to throw that extra clip. Also, something that's kind of new on their boxes, if you see this, this used to just be like a solid, this was like a pink color, um, almost like a pink purpley mix of a color, and it just said DIY Diamond Art Kit. Now it says the DIY Diamond Art Kit, but it also says square so this one obviously is a square painting and this one is in pink and it is round diamond so now you can tell from just like looking at the box from far away if it's square or round thought i would just add that extra little tidbit in for you okay i'm off for real this time bye guys Thank you for watching and if you haven't already and would like to subscribe, don't forget to hit that subscribe button below and the bell icon to be notified when I put up a new video.